How to get access tokens on your Shopify store. Hey everyone and welcome. We hope you're all doing great. In this video, I will show you step by step how to do so. Now, this is going to work uh, with specific apps. Sometimes they actually ask you for this. Now, regardless on why you actually want to use the token, I'm just going to show you how to find one or create one. So, first uh, step is going to be going to the apps section. And then you just want to go ahead and go to uh, app and sales channel settings. So once you click on that, we basically want to click on develop apps on the top. You should find Shopify app store and develop apps. You want to click on develop apps. So once you find yourself in here, if it's your first time, you just want to go ahead and click on allow custom app development. Uh, if it's, this is not showing for you, that's completely fine. That means you've already been in this page, I believe. So anyways, just go ahead and click on allow. And then you just want to allow this one more time. Now in here, you obviously want to create your app. So click on create an app, give it a name, which mm, could be specified by the app that you want to use. You can just go ahead and add any name. In my case, I'm just going to name it test. And then we can just cl click on create app. Give it a little bit of time and it's just going to be created here for us. Uh, but we're not done yet. So here we can actually see uh, we have our configuration, API credentials, everything in between, but we don't have. So for example, the API key and secret key are going to be visible in the API credentials. Uh, you can copy them if you want to, but if you want to create um, your token, you just want to go ahead and follow these steps with the token. So you don't have ac uh, any access to tokens yet. To get an access token, select your API access scope. So I'm going to go for the storefront. Uh, obviously, you can feel free to choose whichever one is going to suit you best. And then you would want to select the things that are required. Now, if you are doing this to install a specific app, most likely than not, they're going to also show you the type of uh, scopes you need to select. But in my case, I'm just going to select some random stuff here and click on save. Just give it a little bit of time and then we should be good to go. The only thing left here for us to do is install the app in order to get the token. As you can see, uh, you don't have any access tokens yet. To get your storefront API, API access tokens, install your app. You can do so either by clicking on, sorry, clicking on install app on the top right or right over here. It doesn't really make a difference. Click on install. Just give it a little bit more time. And you should actually see the storefront API access token. All you need to do is just go ahead and copy this, uh, copy this by clicking on this and you should have your token ready to go and to use. So this is pretty much all for this video. Hopefully you found it to be helpful and thanks for watching.